Good morning, fruit lovers. Uh, some people ask me, they say, oh, my mulberry is dead. And I say, it's not necessarily dead. It might just be gone to sleep for the winter. And then what it will do is it'll wake up and look at this. This has got lovely new shoots and it's even got some little baby fruit already coming there. So this is the, this is the black one. And, um, I think from what I've observed the black and the white and the Pakistan have all gone to sleep for the winter the let me show you a couple others you can see the dwarf everywhere kept a couple of leaves at the top but pretty much it lost nearly all its leaves and you know I wonder if some of it's due to the dryness because they like a lot of wet um, but uh, then again, I think about it back in England, mulberries will go to sleep and it's pretty wet in the English winter. Anyway, this, you can see this has got lots of new growth coming on the dwarf ever bearing. The red mulberry kept a lot of its leaves, which is, I don't know, it's weird because this one as well has not given me any fruit. So um, I don't know, maybe it needs a good hack back. Let's just take a little quick trip over here to show you. I also have the Tice. The Tice went to sleep, like the red one and the white one as well. This is the Pakistan. And you can see like half of it's gone to sleep and half of it hasn't, but these buds are gonna bust open and then it'll have a whole bunch of new growth there. Anyway, I thought I'd share that with you. The difference is, and don't get despondent, if your uh, plants go to sleep for the winter because they're probably going to come back.